Okay, now before we keep going and doing more customization on our editor windows, we need to clean up our files a little bit, right? Like if this is a larger game, how could I organize this stuff uh, in a way that doesn't cause us headaches? There's another important thing I wanna talk about, which is editor folders. The first thing I'm gonna do is I'm going to create a folder and just call it separator attribute specifically. Uh, and inside of here, now here's the interesting thing. I said that this separator drawer should be inside of an editor folder because it is using Unity Editor, it is using editor scripts. We do not want that to be you know, built out. So as long as it's inside of an editor folder, it's fine. This editor folder can actually be inside of separator attribute or inside of a subfolder. It's fine because it's still inside of an editor folder. We could have multiple editor folders, right? Like what if we had, for example, uh, we'll create another folder and we'll call this Monster Maker. Inside of this folder, maybe we start putting our monster script. So we'll, you know, we'll drag and drop this one. We'll even put our data definition in there. And remember, there's a difference between the uh, the monster maker data versus our actual data. Like these are the instances of our data objects. Uh, this is our script that tells how to create that. What else? We have our monster type. You know, we could put that in there. We have our patrol between points. Maybe that's not related to the monster maker. I, you know, I don't know yet. This is kind of just a random example. Uh, we'll keep that out. Scenes, scenes might be separate. So uh, let's see, materials that might be separate. Icons, maybe our icons are related to our monster maker. So I'll put that in there. Yeah, maybe we'll put our data folder inside of Monster Maker, uh, but we'll keep that inside of its own little folder. And separator attribute. Let's actually put the separator attribute inside of our folder here. You know, if we had multiples, we could call this attributes and make lots of separate ones. Um, but the key idea that I'm getting at here is that if I wanted to reuse my separator attribute, I may just want to grab this folder and use everything that's inside of it, right? Which would include the uh, attribute and the editor script for drawing it to the window. I can just grab this folder and take it. If eventually I want the monster maker folder, I want to be able to grab this whole folder and take it and it should reasonably work, right? Like right now we have some materials that are dependent on it. You know, what, what the final graphical, you know, what materials we use and stuff, we, we don't care about that quite yet. Uh, we're just, worried about the system being functional and then we can package all the final stuff up. But at the very least, our scripts and our icons are in inside of here and uh, we know that we'll need those. Um, still undecided on patrol between points, so we'll just keep that separate. So what, what I'm getting at here is inside of Monster Maker, we could actually have a second editor script. And if we wanted to do some editor customization, we would want to use a Unity editor script for that, but we would put that inside of an editor folder. Um, we can have multiple editor folders and when we need to use an editor script, we can put it inside of there. So I believe that whenever we're building it out, it will just not look at the editor folders so we can ignore those scripts when we build it out. I believe that's how, how it works uh, or something very similar. It doesn't need to all be in one giant editor folder. I actually don't recommend that. Uh, keep your editor scripts nearby uh, to the scripts that they're editing because it it's just going to be easier on you. So yeah, just like if you want to customize an editor for a particular script, just create an editor folder there and uh, put it there. So now that we have this organized a little bit better, we can start to continue to expand on our little system here. Because eventually I would like to uh, take any one of these and pull that out and know that it's self-contained and know that it works.